Hi everybody, today I'm going to talk to you about what's the best type of rice to use, what's the differences between the four types of rices and why you should choose one or the other. So what I've got in front of me are the four most common types of rice. I have white rice, I have brown rice, I have red rice and I have black rice. Now white rice is the most common rice. This is what we grew up eating, this is what I grew up eating and uh, I was shocked to learn that white rice dissolves into glucose faster in my bloodstream than sugar. Okay, let me repeat that. White rice versus white sugar. If I eat both of them, this will turn into glucose in my bloodstream faster than sugar. And why is that? So white rice has a very high glycemic index. So for those of you who don't know, glycemic index is the rate at which something converts to glucose in the body. The higher the glycemic index, the faster it will turn to glucose in the body. So white rice, the glycemic index is faster, is higher than white table sugar. So um, that's the problem with white rice, one of the two problems with white rice. The second thing with white rice is that the bran, the grain, the husk, the germ, everything has been stripped out of the white rice. So it has almost no fiber. So what happens when you eat a food that has no fiber and a high glycemic index is that it goes into your body and it converts to sugar really fast. It goes out of your system and then you feel hungry again. So if you're diabetic, your sugar level will likely spike with a white rice and then as it goes down, you will get hungry and then you'll want to eat again. And uh, what you want to do is have a more constant sugar level. Uh, this also, by the way, impacts you in weight gain. Uh, fiber is very good to have because it slows down your digestive process and you don't want to overeat. So next, we have brown rice. Uh, so white and brown rice are uh, very similar, except for brown rice only has the outer hull removed, but it has the bran and the grain uh, still inside. So uh, brown rice is medium in terms of glycemic index, but it does have, <coughs> excuse me, 3.2 grams of fiber. So the fiber is extremely beneficial for you. It also has uh, more protein than white rice. Then we come next to uh, red rice. Uh, red rice is common to or native to many parts of India, especially Uttarakhand in the mountains near Delhi. And then also in Kerala, uh, people use red rice. Uh, red rice has more fiber and protein uh, than brown rice. Um, but also it has more minerals and it has antioxidants and vitamins. So that's why red rice is a, is a good rice. But more importantly, from a diabetes standpoint, red rice has a very low glycemic index, which means that when you eat it, the sugars in uh, the red rice or the carbohydrates which will convert to uh, glucose in your body does it over a slower rate. So hypothetically speaking, if this would be all in and out in your sugar system in one hour, this might be two hours and this might be three hours. Now I'm just making up these numbers, but this is an example of what the glycemic index means. And then we have black rice. Black rice is a different strain of rice. It even has a little bit of gluten in it. It has the most fiber of all of these rices and also the most amount of protein. Uh, black rice also is high in minerals and vitamins uh, and also has iron and uh, also a low glycemic index. So now that's the data, right? What do you use? So from a diabetes standpoint, uh, these two are the best, the red and the black. Uh, from a weight loss and a weight maintenance standard, uh, these three are fine. But again, these two are better uh, just because it has more stuff in it. Now, if you're trying to switch and you find it hard to eat these, you can do a little cheat. You can do 50-50, 50 white and 50 something else. Or you can then uh, slowly work your way to cutting out the white rice. Um, 
The other thing I want to inform you about eating good rice is stay away from the processed rice, like the instant rice. So the instant brown rice or instant anything. Because the instant part comes from some processing. <clears throat> the plant is the same, the, the grain is the same. What, how did it become instant? So that comes through a processing. And to stay healthy, you want to eat minimally processed foods. So if your pack says instant, which by the way, we have one in our kitchen. Um, my driver got it. It's instant brown rice, 15 minutes. Uh, we have to get rid of that now. So watch out for buying those things. And I hope you found this video informative. Um, reach out to us if you want any recipes on how to make this tastier. Uh, we're constantly doing R&D and how to get a more fluffier and moist brown rice. We're about to start a lot on the red and the black now. And stay tuned, stay tuned to the Cure My Diabetes channel for more information on leading a healthier life. Thank you.